Okay, this morning finds me working on a temporary cold frame. And all this is, is, I can take my gloves off here. All this is, is greenhouse material, sun tuft, and a big old snowmobile tote. Oh, and, and that's really warm already, which is awesome. And this makes a great cold frame material because one, that the tote is black, and this is black or dark. And where we had it on the old ice shack, it has vent holes already. Also, you can see underneath there, those ridges provide vent holes as well. So this is really good for a cold frame this time of year. And uh, these have been a storage over there for the winter. So I just started cleaning them off. And that's what they looked like before I dumped the stuff off from in the winter time and this is all work in progress my grow bags that I gotta replace put somewhere else a compost thing that I'm gonna put someplace else and I have a compost pile here inside here that's gonna stay <coughs> excuse me and uh, some of these logs are gonna be moved over and behind there but right now i'm waiting for us to get the boat in the water so i don't have to roll out around there and all around just to get them to over there oh and you can tell I'm a black fly in my eye um this is how i started out this morning you see the black fly right in the corner of my eye i don't know um, <coughs> they got one in my mouth. How'd that get down in there? I don't know. Um, so the black flies are out. And I had this on and this on to help me uh, stay warmer this morning. And what I'm going to do is now if the black flies are out, it's probably 50 degrees. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to swap this hat out into my other hat, which is sprayed with bug stuff. And uh, get back to working on this, clean this up. And what I'm going to do this up what I'm going to do is put this these long ones long narrow ones across here to help the whole weight that down then I'm going to put this plastic over the top of that and then I'm going to weight it down with this junk board here the slab and then I'm just going to monitor that throughout the day and see how warm it gets so I know what to do with my plants 